Recession alarm bells are ringing loud. Countless publications are saying that recession is coming. With the Fed likely to raise rates several times this year, will they trigger a recession? Recession talk is in the air, and it seems nearly all news sources are saying the same thing. From conservative Fox News stating, U.S. barreling toward recession, experts say as inflation hits 40-year high. To more liberal CNN's headline, U.S. economy flashes a recession warning sign. To former Obama economic advisor Larry Summers, new warning, Fed heading for stagflation and recession. Federal Reserve has been wrong on inflation for a year. Publication after publication are all giving recession warnings. What is everyone so up in arms about? Yes, it's true that inflation is getting worse month after month, beating 40-year records, and is expected to get worse. But why are we talking about recession? When inflation rises dramatically, it usually triggers Fed action to raise interest rates. In the 70s, when Fed Chair Paul Volcker was faced with inflation problems, interest rates were raised to nearly 20%. As interest rates went up, so did inflation, hitting 14.8% as companies passed the high cost of debt onto goods and services. Right now, experts fear is that the current Fed Chair, Powell, could follow Volcker's footsteps, as this New York Times article points out. Powell admires Paul Volcker. He may have to act like him. The Federal Reserve is facing the fastest inflation most Americans have ever seen. Its chair says policymakers will do what it takes to tame prices. And for those of you who don't know, I'd like to point out that the Fed just raised rates 0.25% and is planning for more rate heights this year. Fed raises rates and plots strategy of steady further increases. What analysts and economists know is that every recession since 1955 has been preceded by rising interest rates. In this chart, every gray bar represents a recession, and you can see how every one was preceded by rising interest rates. Anyone who's been paying attention to Fed actions in the past might be experiencing a bit of deja vu right now. And that's why analysts like David Rosenberg are saying, prepare for recession this summer, a bear market in real estate and a drop in stock prices, warns strategist David Rosenberg. Clearly the warning signs are there. Massive amounts of experts are saying recession is coming. So the question now, is are you prepared? What steps have you taken, if any, to prepare for the next recession? If you want to learn more about what's going on in the economy and ways to prepare, sign up for a one-on-one web conference with our education team at AugustaPreciousMetals.com. Hey guys, Joe Montana here with my man Devlin Steele. He and his team at Augusta Precious Metals are constantly putting out new information to keep you ahead of the game. Click subscribe now and hit the notification bell to stay up to date. You'll be glad you did.